गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज द सेकेंड वीडियो ऑन दिस चैप्टर द चैप्टर नेम इज फ्रैक्शन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व सम ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम्स बेस्ड ऑन द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ फ्रैक्शन सो लेट स्टार्ट सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज दैट कंपेयर सिक्स अपन फिफ्टीन एंड थ्री अपन फिफ्टीन वी नो दैट वेन एवर द डिनोमिनेटर आर सेम द फ्रैक्शन हैविंग द हाइएस्ट डिनोमिनेटर इज द ग्रेटेस्ट फ्रैक्शन सो वी आर सिक्स अपन फिफ्टीन is greater than p upon 15 this is the common rule whenever there is the denominator same the fraction having the highest numerator is the greatest one now look at this fraction compare 6 upon 11 and 3 upon 19 here we see that this fraction having the different denominators so what is the shortest rule to compare these two fractions let us cross multiply so 6 upon 11 And three upon nineteen. Write the fraction. Just con, uh, multiply, cross multiply. Six with nineteen and eleven upon three. So six upon nineteen will be the left side. Eleven upon three the right side. So how it will be possible? Six into nineteen and three into eleven. Or uh, six into nineteen how much? Six nine. Hundred fourteen. And three into eleven is how much? Thirty-three. So which is greater? And definitely the hundred fourteen is greater. So hundred fourteen in which side? The left side. Therefore, we conclude that six upon eleven is greater than three upon nineteen. Okay. Now look at this question. Arrangement in ascending and descending order. So how you arrange the fraction having different denominators here? And which is greater, which is smaller? When you have more than two fractions are there, you can arrange ascending or descending order. So here, the formula is find out the LCM of the all the denominators of the fractions. So LCM of three, four, two, first we have to multiply to solve it. First we have to find out. So here, the LCM of three, four, two because three is a prime number. Two is a, when number suppose here two is divided two one hundred. So it will, it will be three is here because the prime number two two zero four and two one zero two. Now LCM is LCM equal to two into three into two. That is six into two is twelve. So we got here LCM equal to twelve now. So write the LCM here. So first fraction is two into three two upon three. So make the denominator twelve. So three into how much will be twelve? Three into four is twelve. Same number you multiply here also in the numerator. Two four is eight here. So next fraction is five upon four. So the denominator should be twelve because the same is twelve. Because the same is twelve we got here. So four into three is twelve and definitely five into three multiply here. Five into three is fifteen. Now next fraction is one upon two. So which number you multiply so the denominator will be twelve. Definitely it will be six. So multiply with six in the numerator also. So one to six is six. Six upon twelve. Now all the denominators are the same. Whenever the denominator is same, the fraction having the highest numerator is the greatest one. So fifteen upon twelve is the greatest one. Greater than which fraction? It is eight upon twelve. Greater than six upon twelve. Okay. This way we can arrange the fractions having different denominators. Now we are going to solve the addition and subtraction of fractions. Look at this question. It says that add four upon eleven plus three upon eleven. So here we see that the denominators are same. So write the denominator here eleven. So four plus three equal to seven by eleven. It is very simple. Now look at here. It is a mixed fractions. So mixed fraction first we have to convert it to improper fraction. So seven four hundred twenty eight twenty eight plus one twenty nine. So it is equal to twenty nine upon four plus this will be four hundred twelve plus one thirteen or plus four. So the here denominator is same. So four you can write in denominator. So twenty nine plus thirteen in the numerator part. So twenty nine plus thirteen will be three plus nine twelve two one carry. So two four. Forty-two upon four. Now for the it can be minimized. So into two two is four. Two two is 
4, 1, so it will be 21 upon 2. Now it can be in each fraction, convert to each fraction, 2 and 20 and plus 1. So 10 whole 1 upon 2 is the solution. Now look at this question, it says that it is subtraction. Subtract, it says that subtract. Subtract what? 2 upon 9 from 7 upon 9. So 7 upon 9 will come first. 7 upon 9 minus 2 upon 9. So here 9 is the denominator. So 7 minus 2 in the numerator, right? 7 minus 2 will be 5 upon 9. So it is a proper fraction. Now this minus subtraction you do subtract this from this. So first 11 uh, 4 4 upon 7 will come. Then minus 6 4 2 upon 7. So it will be 11 7 plus 77. 77 plus 4 it will be 81. 81 upon 7 minus 6 7 is 42. 42 plus 2 44. 44 upon 7. So denominator is same here. So 81 minus 44 is the numerator. So what is the solution here? 81 minus 11 minus 4 will be 7. Then here 7 minus 4 is 3. So 37 upon 7. It is a improper fraction. Make it to mixed fraction. So 7 5 are 35. 35 plus 2 is 37. So 5 whole 2 upon 7 is the solution. Now we are going to solve some fractions having different denominator. These are called unlike fraction. So in the last uh, example we have seen the like fractions. Now it is unlike fractions. So how you can solve with unlike fraction? So first step is to make the denominator same. How to make the denominator same? By the help of LCM. So LCM of 4, 6, 8. How much? LCM of 4, 6, 8 will be. Let's see what is the LCM? 2 goes 4, 2 3 are 6, 2 4 is 8. Now here it is for the unit 2, 12 is 2, 3 to 2. So now multiply 2 is 4, 4 3 is 12, 20 is 24. So we see that the LCM of these 3 numbers is 24. So 24 now 24 divided by 4, how much? 6. 6 into 3 is 18 plus. Plus. So 24 divided by 6 is 4. 4 into 5 is 20 plus. 24 divided by 8 is 3. 3 into 7 is 21. Make plus now mention 1, 8, 9 here. 2 to 4, 1, 5. 59. 59 upon 24 is the solution. Okay. Now we can make it a mixed fraction also. So now look here in this example we see that subtract. It is question say that subtract this minus this. So it is a mixed fraction. Also we see that the denominator is different here. So first step is make it to which fraction? Improper fraction. 4 6 are 24, 24 plus 1, 25, 25 upon 6 minus 3 9, 27 plus 2, 29 upon 9. So now the next step is to find out the LCM of 6 and 9. So what is the LCM of 6 and 9? Let's find out 6, 9 LCM. 3 is given 3 to the 6, 3 to the 9. So 3 to the 6, 3 the 18. We see here that the LCM of 6 and 9 is 18. 18 divided 6 is 3. 3 into 25. 25 3 is 75. Minus. Now 18 divided 9 is 2. 2 into 29 is 2 9 that is 1 3 4 58. So that is equal to 15 minus 8 is 7. And 6 minus 5 is 1. 17 upon 18 is the solution. Okay. So this is the method how to uh, solve the addition and subtraction of fractions. So first step is to find out the LCM, if the denominator are not same, the find out the LCM and then, uh, then, then the normal process applied. That means the LCM is divided by the denominator and multiplied by the numerator. Okay.